Well, Detroit's Merrill Davis and Charlie White made history becoming the first U.S. ice dance team to win Olympic gold at the Olympics. Ever since that moment, they have been asked time and time again if they would defend their title at the 2018 Winter Olympics. Today, they finally answered that question for us, and Jamie Edmonds says they feel very good about their decision. Well, Devin, Karen, fans might be a little bit disappointed yeah. on said decision because Merrill Davis and Charlie White say they're not competing next season. That means they won't make a run for the Winter Olympic Olympics in South Korea, Korea, but you'll still see them on the ice. I hate to be a little bit of a downer, maybe for our fans, but we've decided not to compete at the Olympics. Uh, Charlie and White and Merrill decision? Davis I mean, broke just, the news on so the Today many, Show. So they will not compete in the next Winter Olympics. Merrill says it was a huge decision. I think it's one that we really allowed ourselves to take a long time, as you said, three years to, to make. And um, we explored, uh, you know, all of the options, you know, all of our emotions, how we were feeling. So to have really come to that conclusion is, is something that, uh, that feels really good. Merrill and Charlie enjoy what they're doing now. They're focused on improving their show skating and performing for their fans, including Stars on Ice this spring. Metro Detroit remains home for them, and it's still the training center for ice dance teams around the world. There's a, a, a really high level of ice dancing coming out of the United States and especially coming out of the Detroit area. U.S. Olympic hopefuls include national champions Maya and Alex Shibatani, who train in Canton, and Madison Chalk and Evan Bates, who train in Novi. Just to give you an idea of the kind of shape American ice dance is in right now. Uh, we had two teams on the world podium at last year's world championships. We had three teams in the top six at the world championships, and that is a huge feat. And while they may not be competing, Merrill and Charlie hope to be at the next Olympics. After you win the Olympics, I think that you have a certain responsibility um, to, to take charge and to, to help lead communities and, and certainly you know our country in, in, in a positive direction. And I think that that's something that we really have taken to heart. Yeah, and Merrill and Charlie say they're looking for opportunities to have a role during the 2018 Winter Games, and they want to thank you, Metro Detroit, for always supporting their careers.